All right, what's up guys? This is Tyler here with Board Insiders. I'm getting ready to do the flex test on the 2014 Rossignol Rock and Roller. This is a 152 centimeter board. It's got a camber profile of 20% cambered, so 20% of the board, which is from here to here, inside is cambered. And then from here to here, out to the tips is reverse cambered. So two different camber zones. Let's see how that treats us. This board also has uh, raised edges, so slightly uh, it's actually not raised edges, it's actually a milled core, so the edges are lifted off right here. They're never really touching. Board Insiders. Real riders, real reviews. All right, and the first thing I do is just kind of lean in just with my body weight, not really trying to pull too much. There's not really a lot of resistance. I can feel it fighting in the middle of the board a little bit more than on the ends, but I really feel no, no resistance anywhere. When I really like put weight on it, I can feel that it wants to flex right in here and right here more than it does right here. So it got like a stiff zone a little bit right here and in between and the tips is super flexy. You can see right under my feet, so pretty much the insert zone is the end that does, that's where it doesn't want to bend, but everywhere, everywhere else is super low resistance. Torsional flex on this, oh that's super comfortable. Oh yeah, you're going to get a lot of maneuverability out of this board. And there's the maximum flex. Oh yeah, I did ride this board. Uh, it was super playful on the mountain, super maneuverable. And definitely, you could butter and uh, nose press just like that on the mountain. For the latest snowboard reviews, check out BoardInsiders.com.